Hey everyone, today we are going to make a transitional surface example in SOLIDWORKS. As you see on the screen, I have a model uh, prepared before, and now we are going to follow the same steps and we are going to have our surface model. Let's start. We are opening a new part, and firstly, I will create my independent uh, bodies. I'm always starting with some construction lines when you are opening a plane or for other needs they are really useful uh, from the center 80 millimeters and diameter is 50 one is this and Extruded surfaces, we are reversing direction and 100 millimeters. Uh, I need a plane to the wide surface here. As you see, our plane is here. We should open a, another plane here. I'm choosing my line and then front plane. And now with intersection command. Versus plane, second is body. I divide it into two pieces, my body, and another <coughs> uh, independent body. It is 100 millimeter distances, uh, and same diameter I'm using 50, as you see. Now we are extruded, but I want it to start a little bit uh, on other uh, side distance, like 100 mm uh, further from this uh, our main plane, which is the yeah, plane. Now uh, I have a plane here, which is exactly in the middle of this part, and I'm dividing into two pieces of again this body. Now I'm hiding unnecessary things on the screen. I'm going to use boundary surface command. Uh, we are choosing two uh, surface, and as you see, surface is here. And then we are opening a tangency option two, and for is for two also this one and creating a transitional surface here. We are able to make these connections by independent sketches also. But it's a for a middle now, for that reason we don't need so much. Now I'm going to mirror my bodies. As you see. Now <coughs> the thing is now we must make to connect these two surfaces. Again same comment boundary surface. Uh, side is important, for example, if I'm choosing this uh, edge, I must choose also from the another side, the same direction as. Now I'm opening the tangency option, now my tangency ratio is 3, here again, here again 3, uh, but I must change the direction. It is looking a little bit much, we can make 2.5 and it is done. Of course we can make this connection again with boundary surfaces with uh, other sketches but I'm just using here now these comments. And now last thing is the, uh, filling these gaps for that reason I'm choosing fill surfaces. Contact tangent. If you choose apply all edges all edges will be tangent. That's done and again fill surfaces as you see here also tangent contact and apply for all edges yeah our model is ready uh, to make it a little bit handsome I'm going to choose the surfaces what I made some colors on it you know yeah, that's done. This much easy. I hope you can follow same 
steps and early models.